Good evening, you're watching India News Stream. This is Sana Aziz with today's news headlines. With 134 seats, the Aam Aadmi Party today won the prestigious battle for the Municipal Corporation of Delhi, ending the 15-year rule of the BJP. The Municipal Corporation of Delhi today got its first transgender councillor after Aam Aadmi Party's Bobby Kinner won the civic polls from Sultanpuri AIM ward. RBI today increased the repo rate by 35 BPS to continue battle against inflation. Rajya Sabha Chairman Jagdeep Dhankar today raised the issue of Supreme Court striking down the NGAC Act during his maiden speech in the House. The All India Muslim Personal Law Board today said it will move the Supreme Court against the CBI Special Court acquittal of all the 32 accused in the 1992 Babri Masjid demolition case. Christian Michel, an alleged middleman in the Augusta Westland chopper scam case, has claimed in a handwritten letter from Tihar Jail to UK Prime Minister Rishi Sunak that he is being abused in a Delhi jail and is being held without trial, without charge, without bail since four years. The Multi-State Cooperative Society's Bill 2022 was introduced in the Lok Sabha today amid demands from the opposition to send the proposed legislation to the Standing Committee, alleging that it encroaches on the jurisdiction of states. Activist and former JNU student Shurjil Imam has moved the Supreme Court seeking to expunge certain remarks made against him by the Delhi High Court in its order denying bail to co-accused Umar Khalid in the Delhi right case. Union Finance Minister Nirmala Sitharaman and US Vice President Kamala Harris are among Forbes' 19th annual list of world's 100 most powerful women of 2022. Nepal's cabinet has decided to lift an eight-month-long ban on the import of some vehicles, liquor products and expensive mobile sets from December 16. That's all for now. We'll come back with more news updates shortly.